Hello, I'm doing this video because I haven't vlogged in a very long time and the latest one is that uh, proposal vlog which kind of got me thinking like I want to vlog, I want to shoot things but sometimes there's nothing to shoot and then I sort of thought about the other thing which is like do we always need something to shoot or do we find things that we want to shoot along the way so I think what I'm going to try is I'm going to try to vlog every week whenever I go out even when there's nothing to vlog about I'll try to vlog about something so yeah I think this is going to be the start of Bolia vlog it's very bold on anything that goes and I think with the start of it I'm just gonna introduce my space my new workspace at home okay so this is gonna be my new workspace previously I had my little standing desk thing over there but over time I realized that I'm using it in a very weird squat seat setting more so eventually I decided to make go with it and shift bought a folding table again from Decathlon because this is going to be used in future when I move houses um, and set the table as such so in a sense I have more space to move my mouse around as well so I have a Keychron Q1 uh, I liked it because it was cheap gasket mount and uh, couldn't afford a QMMK Pro really enjoy because the typing experience is not bad like it's just it's very pingy very metallic so the only thing I did so far a tempest tape mod whereby you put like masking tape underneath uh, but next I'm probably gonna open it up again and then put in some foam next time but yeah typing sound Uh, drinking tea is a uh, is something I like to do in the afternoons uh, when I'm stressed out, need some time to wind down. I, I really enjoy the idea of brewing tea on your own to relax, and that's the reason why I got uh, this little guy one from Tea Pottery. Love it so much. Very very uh, nicely crafted, brew very nice. I I don't know if this is the correct material for Liu Bao but it's the only one I have so too bad mix up and then this little cup here is something that I made together with Shireen when we both signed up for a beginner introductory uh, pottery class at Tao Ceramic really like it a lot I mean the glaze is not done by me but the shape of the cup is done by me so yeah a little bit of meaning there lah, which I really enjoy is this made in China temperature controlled gooseneck kettle which I absolutely love Good wind down or a rest time if you are busy working every day and I guess well yeah that's about it I'm actually over at Circuit Road right now this is along the way that of my cycling path home so I've noticed this area has quite a lot of very interesting food especially this Hanjiang uh, seafood that by my perspective is the one that started this trend of like freshly steamed seafood prepared at cheap prices it's so cheap in fact this big golden prompter soup rice is only $7.50 very cheap and it's so fresh soybean and chili dipping sauce to go with the fish really brings out the sweetness and the 
freshness of it. So depending on what time you arrive at the place, if you arrive a bit earlier, chances are you can still get the sea bass. But I arrive a bit late, so by the time I arrive, right, it's not even the normal size golden prompter that's left, it's the large size. Normal size is only 650, this one is 750. Even then, right, for 750, I think this is super worth the money. Another thing to take note of is the waiting time. I think when I ordered, right, there was a very long queue, so by the time I was there, waiting time is about 35 minutes for this, which is fine, I guess. But yeah, either way, long story short, I think if you want to try this, you should come a bit earlier. In for maybe 6, 6 p.m. when they start. So friends, aside from just fish, they also have other stuff such as uh, fragrant prawns as well as lala and also omelette. La. So if you want to try something else, it's equally fresh, it's equally nice. From my perspective, they were the OG and it spurred a lot of, I wouldn't call it copycat but similar concept ideas. In fact, I think further down there's another one as well. It's a much needed refill before I head back and continue my journey home. So my original plan was to vlog and vlog and vlog until it hit a 10 minute duration after which I'll post it as a long YouTube video but I figured that you know I like playing games too much and trying to set things into a 10 minute break it's gonna take forever and by the time the stuff is up it's probably super outdated so the plan is that I will instead just post them as as immediate as I can with each event uh, whether or not it's 3 minutes, 5 minutes, 6 minutes or even 10 minutes I'll just post it as it is and hopefully with that I can bring in a little bit more consistency so yeah this, this uh, weekly promise is not happening man I'm sorry <laughs>